Moving on to the waste unit of the real grade wing Gundam Zero EW. Here's the waste unit which I removed from the inner frame. And we take this part, slide it into place like so until it goes all the way in. We have this little red part here that goes right onto this. Yee! I hope it goes in. Oh, you have to slide it into place. There we go. Alright. So that takes care of that. Now, according to the manual, I need to take this. And I guess I gotta bend this? Oh yeah, I gotta bend it. Like that. For this way. And that. For that away. I didn't paint this. Then we take this part here, put it in like so, and then repeat the same one here. Alright, so I'm now seeing my first nonsense. Even though I had this on uh, reversible tape and I painted everything forward the back shows the blue I'm gonna have to see what I can do to cover that up but going now to the next part which ooh, I forgot there are two parts missing here where are you I thought I had everything ready up oh, there it is forgot to pull them out so uh, we take this part here, put that under like so, and like the same thing what we did with um, these parts, put it in here, flip that around, make sure it goes all the way in, get these two, put them there. Same thing here. Ah. Let me hold that into place. There we go. Ah. What am I doing wrong? Yep, they went all the way in. Hopefully this thing's not going to come out all the time. Alright, that's fair enough. That's good enough right there. Now, I'm, I pulled these out by accident, not realizing that this is, goes into the uh, waist, into the body of the, um, of the uh, real grade. So, we'll leave this here, and then move on to the next part, which will be the the torso and here are all the parts ready for assembly first up we'll need this slide this up through here like so next we will need this part I look good this and I believe Hmm. Oh, let's go this way. Let's go like that, and that, and how these notches are are set up into place, like so, like this. Then we need this. So that one goes like that over here. And then we take the glass part. I'm going to put it in this position where I snipped off the, plastic, the clear plastic so it doesn't show off the scars. And then just put this one right on top, like so. Okay, I think that's how it works.
and then you put it in like that. Now we need this part here. It snaps into place like so. This part goes here. Let's find the positioning. Oh, right, here we go. So it goes like that. Then you have this red part. Now, there are two little notches here at the top, so you want to line them up so the notches are to the sides like that. And put it in like this, as how I'm seeing it here, followed by the neck. Which will, oh, which those notches are used to align up this. Okay. Doesn't want to go all the way, but fair enough. We'll leave it the way it is. And then we have these two side parts. One goes through here. The other one goes through there. Well, it's nicely snapped in. And then you have the uh, over-the-shoulder Gatling guns, which I did paint the Gatling guns. So one goes here. The other one goes there. Oh, wow. And then finally, like I mentioned before, the uh, two side skirts easily... Whoops. One goes here. And then the other one goes there. Yeah. Kind of okay with what I'm seeing here. Oh, we might as well put this one on so we don't forget. That one goes there. goes right here and this one goes right there all right the torso of the real grade wing Gundam EW or wing Gundam zero excuse me is now complete okay very nice all right let's now move on to the next part of the build so the next part of the build is going to be the arms of the Wing Gundam Zero EW. I'll remove the fist first. And according to this, we'll need this back here and this back here. I'll go over this. Like so. Now, for this, since this is the right arm, or excuse me, yeah, the right arm, you want to make sure that this part is like this. You slide it in like that. Then there's a part here that there's a guide that slides down like so. Now, I'm going to do this on camera and I may end up regretting it. But these are things that, you know, as a model builder, you have to take chances. When I put this on um, the previous kit, the previous arm, it wouldn't go through all the way, not because uh, it's not supposed to fit there, it's just because of, maybe because of the paint. But also, I have a distinct feeling that it should go all the way. So I'm going to shave off a little bit at the tip. And then slowly 
really bit carefully. Clean this off a bit. I'm gonna add, if it's loose, it's fine because I could just add just a tad of glue. Just be very careful. Okay. So supposedly, it has to go this way. Yeah, there she goes. There we go. Then we have the clear part here. into there, like so, and then take this, and then like that. Make sure you put it, push it into the sides, you don't want to accidentally crush this. Hear a truck outside, so I'm sorry for the end, for that noise. Then you want to push it all the way. Make sure it goes all the way until it snaps in. Then we take this, slide it in through that, and then. Use one of these for the for the fist. What do you think of that? Now, as I was preparing this, I didn't realize that when you put this on, it is a pain in the ass to take off because I accidentally put this on the wrong shoulder, so taking it off was a pain, and I didn't want to make a mistake again so I said you know what we'll leave it the way it is for now we'll leave it the way it is so there's a charcoal part that goes there because you need this to go through here you have this part that goes on top and then you have the orange uh, orange yellow part then you find the notch and peg goes in all the way because it has to have that little circle thing. Then this, I want to put it like this so the notch is facing that way. And you know what? Let me just double check that in the manual. Yes, that is correct, I think. So I want to make sure it goes all the way. Where's my tool? Actually, correction, there's a notch here that goes like this, so I apologize. It's the other way around. I was like wondering why that didn't go through. Alright, there we go. And then we take this little guy. Put it like so. And then we have this. It goes in the opposite direction. Once it goes in, I don't want to pull this out again. Alright. I think that's pretty much it. Then we just take this. Slide that through here. And we're done. The arms of the real grade Wing Gundam Zero EW is now complete. Starting to come out really good. Alright, let's now move on to the next part.